Hello everybody, this is Jesse from Napco Tech Support. And today in this video, we're going to go over how to enable your Firelink FACP for remote downloading through the integrated Starlink radio. We're going to start by locating the panel's master security code loaded, located inside the enclosure and note that. Now what we're need, going to need to do is enable the programming to accept the download. So what we're going to do is on the keypad enunciator, we're going to enter in our master code. And then hit the enter button, and you'll see it will say keypad unlocked. Now we're going to hit the menu button until we see the selection that says enable programming. Once we see enable programming, we're going to hit the next yes key. And now the panel will go into an E28 error check trouble. We can hit acknowledge to silence the trouble. Now the system is ready to accept a remote fire download um, from Quick Loader through the integrated radio. The same steps can also be used on the GEMC commercial series panels when using remote programming. The only way to clear this E28 error is to do a successful error-free download from Quick Loader into the panel. Now, just to review, we went over how to enable our Firelink FACP for remote download through the integrated Starlink radio. And as always, for more information, you can visit us on the web at tech.napgosecurity.com. Thank you all so much for watching today.